It's Friday, 21st April, around 10 o'clock. So today, I've been wanting to cook shrimp. Uh, uh, Sasa and Paul likes it. Nelia, not so much. Ingredients are salt, garlic, onions, pepper, teriyaki sauce, and butter. Not shown here along with the shrimp. Now cooking teriyaki uh, shrimp, don't cook too much and it has to be cooked in less than 10 minutes otherwise this shrimp becomes rubber and uh, you don't want that. So uh, my cooking style tend to be uh, quick, uh, not prolonged. The only time I cook long is rescaldo and uh, if the meat is tough, boil them, till they become soft, those takes hours. This kind of cooking like pork, broccoli and things, they, you'd want to cook them quick. So, in the case of this, I, I bought about a kilo. I'm not cooking a kilo. That's a lot of shrimp. So cooking, sh uh, I mean, de-shelling shrimp, uh, when I was a cook, I was shown how. Uh, anyway. You you have your own method of deshelling shrimp. I ha I was taught one, so um, since I only have one hand, I can't really show you the the method. Simply that you learn it. Basically, uh, you st you start at the end, and then with your thumb pry this loose at the end. You start at the end, never at the this. And also, uh, just cut off the head, fry it, and. Uh, It'll be good, crunchy. Here's the shrimp, the uh, the scaled, uh, scaled removed, the scaled. Now uh, this is five portion. So uh, having it cooked in North America in a, a dipping uh, style cooking, this would set you back thirty bucks, thirty dollars each uh, portion. Anyway, that's how it is over there. So in this case, uh, let's see, 400, 450 per kilo. So that's uh, a buck. I'm just thinking, what am I thinking? 40 pesos per, per piece. So here's the... Uh, here are the shrimps, uh, the uh, veined. So basically, cut on the top and then remove the uh, the waist. Now you could cut them individually or cut them all at once. Um, or you, if you like it, if you like to have exercise, just cut them individually, uh, one by one. But in this case, I'm just gonna cut them all at once save me time now to, you really need to cook the shrimp really quick so the smaller they are the quicker they'll be cooked but some like it chunky so some people like it chunky I'm just gonna cut them maybe into uh, three pieces per so I'm just gonna do so the, these are now cut into three pieces per shrimp so Actually, I decided to cook them all all at once, uh, so there won't be anything to cook tonight. Something else. S sprinkle uh, peppers everywhere because when you're cooking, you don't have time to deal with this. Adding pepper on the fly, so do it now because you'll be busy stirring the the uh, the food. You want to do it quick, so doing other extraneous activities really is distracting. So. Ahead of time. Okay, I'm about to start the uh, cooking. So I have the butter. You can buy that pure gold or centro. A little bit of water to steam. Onions, garlic, pepper, and the shrimp. Uh, so preparation is key. Uh, make sure everything is uh, around you before doing anything. So the wok is smoking hot. I'm going to add a little bit of oil um, so it doesn't burn the butter ASAP. 
just a little bit that's it so that's the amount so you can see throw that in the, 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 the butter is burning already not good I think I need it too hot So do this quickly. I mean, uh, the shrimp is easy to cook. Now, typically, uh, cooking tipinati it would be a flat surface, and there won't be any uh, uh, water. It will be evaporating immediately. So in this sense, I don't need water. I'm just gonna cover it up. So the, the shrimp is covered, and shrimp is easy to cook. You don't want it to be cooking too long, it'll become rubber. So, uh, in a few seconds, uh, this thing is cooked. Here, there's too much moisture. You really don't want to cook it with lots of moisture. The, the shrimp are shrinking, and I don't like the shrinking weight. It's going to be somewhat rubbery. That's... Uh, that's the way it is if you don't have the right uh, surface to cook uh, this kind of style. Okay, after cooking for a little bit more, uh, I've reduced the water. Uh, the reason why I wanted to uh, do that is the moment I put in the teriyaki sauce, uh, if the onions is not sealed, it will leak uh, more moisture. Uh, so really, it's the, the, the wok should be really hot and throw in the teriyaki sauce it, it should prevent the uh, onions from leaking more water so, uh, or moisture now by this time the shrimp is overcooked it's going to be rubber but oh well I've added the uh, teriyaki sauce uh, now it, it's done so there it is uh, the the shrimp sort of shrunk it may end up being rubber but uh, let's see yeah it's a little bit tough mm. I didn't add any salt I realized the teriyaki uh, salt uh, I realized that teriyaki sauce has salt so up to you though